Hey guys, welcome to the new movie review. Today we're talking about The Invisible Man, a new Blumhouse movie, so let's jump into it. General thoughts, I liked it, it was good. I had a fun time with it. It's a good horror movie if you like horror movies, just to let you know it is a horror movie. Um, by Blumhouse, so that kind of goes without saying. Usually if it's by Blumhouse, it's, they just, pretty much they do horror stuff. So it's kind of, kind of figure that going into it, but, I mean, obviously when the credits it's a horror movie, but it's about a girl who was dating this guy who is completely controlling and awful, and then he creates a suit that becomes invisible and throws his shoulder and does a bunch of crazy stuff to it, and yeah. And also he was doing crazy stuff before, to her beforehand, so, completely asshole, but yeah, the movie's about her trying to prove he's real and stuff, da da da, because he's invisible so nobody can see him, so it's like, trying to prove all this, and it's really great, and I really enjoyed it, it was fun, I really enjoyed it, I had a fun time, and I think, did that, did that cover everything? I think that was off pointing. Also, the only actor that I know is the main actor who plays the girl. He was the one who gets tortured and everything. It was created, like, it has to fight the, uh, Invisible Man to, uh, get her whatever back. To get her life back. Um, she was also in the movie The Kitchen, if you saw that. It was based on a vertical comic, so that was cool. And Stephen and other stuff, but that's the one, the, immediately the thing I think of. But yeah, really good movie. I enjoyed it. Uh, I give it a solid, I was debating on what, what I want. The movie is... The query line I thought it made look a little fast. It's not like it's fast, or it's like, is it slow, or is it a fast movie? I think it's a middle movie where it's like, obviously, the guy's invisible, so he's going around like sneaking around and stuff, so all the points where it's like, almost has to be quiet and stuff. It is a good movie. I give it like a 8 or 9. Uh, I'm gonna go with 8. I'm gonna give it a 9, but I'm like, we'll give it an 8. It's really good. It's it's on a, if, if I have to go in on 8, it is a higher 8, so keep that in mind. It's not a 9, but it's close. It's like a higher 8. So, yeah, really enjoyed the movie. What do you guys think of The Invisible Man? Let me know in the comments down below. And let's talk about it. You guys can always stay epic. And I'll see you in the next movie, you guys. Bye.